dumb vibes is here to entertain you. There are just so many South African soapies that are really beautiful, have a great storyline, and of course, the actors are top notched. Guys, ranging from Skim Sam to Imbe with the Seed and even to Mubango, I watch each and every of the soapies and I love them so very much. But it is really so sad in that it's a final wrap for actress Rosala Navo and Mubango. She has been an outstanding veteran actress as far as this particular soapy is concerned, but now she has been laid off completely and definitely will not be coming back anytime soon or if possible never to this particular soapy because of very very sad things that have happened a lot has transpired that i'm about to give you all the entire details and secrets in this video so make sure you watch this video right up to the end before i give you all the entire information you're welcome to my youtube channel do well to subscribe to this youtube channel like this video drop a comment after watching the entire video and hit on to my post notification bell close curtains light out it's a wrap for veteran actress Murabeli Raslanavo. Raslanavo has been on a recall coaster ride as Vomu Kondeleli, one of the original cast members of Mubango since its inception in 1997 and was seen taking her last breath on set last week. The 72-year-old recalls her days before joining the cast as nerve-wracking yet exciting moments to have an opportunity to be on television, yet she already had full-time job as a teacher and that actually could not stop her. Though it served on several instances as a hindrance, but she did everything within her capacity, within her power in order to always meet up with the program when she's teaching or when she's still not teaching. Russell Navo took Sunday World down memory lane back 25 years ago when she was called for an audition. She recalls when she was given a script written in both Tsonga and English. She had read the script in Tsonga but was asked to change it to Venda and this is when her dream definitely came true. She said and I quote, As I finished my lines, the crew laughed and that had me very much worried because this must mean that I messed up. I didn't even realize that the whole dialogue between myself and the lady behind the counter was being filmed by cameras behind me. Turns out the directors liked me and called me for a second audition and it went on this way until I was called to come back with my dress size, she said. This was a very huge and monumental moment for her and it was a complete change in her entire life. Although she was already over the moon at the thought of being a TV star, she said it was not an easy beginning. The team did not have appropriate clothing for a character that is definitely Nguenda. And she was asked to bring her own wardrobe. As she was driving to shoot in Shidzive village in Limpompo, the wardrobe van fell apart. But all of these were just delays. Nothing was going to see her giving up on her dream. She finally made it to Vo and of course, the gossip mongo wife to the royal Alphios. This was a monumental moment. The actress once had dramatic departure from the cast when she was told to cut off her hair to play the morning wife of Walthius when he passed on and she refused. She was dismissed for refusal to comply with her contractual agreement but her sense is definitely stronger and they had to call her back. This time around, she has left completely from Mubango and she leaves excitedly and super happy. You will tell me what you think about her departure.